Why is my face so red? <coughs> Trash. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my vid. This video is gonna be so trashy and random. But good, but fun. Not so much for me, but maybe for you. Because in this video, I will be trying a filter from TikTok. I'm not just trying it, I'm living it. Maybe you've heard of this one particular girl dinner TikTok sound. This is my meal, I call this girl dinner. Girl, girl, dinner. girl dinner, girl dinner, girl dinner. Girl dinner. It has gained popularity over the past few weeks on TikTok. There's this filter which resulted from this video. And the filter basically just shows you what your girl dinner will be like. It picks those three food ingredients. It's not ingredients, it's actually just part of your food. Food combination. Yeah, I thought the filter was fun to see what my girl dinner was like, but I also thought, why does nobody ever make what the girl dinner filter tells you to make? Why not let this filter decide my whole day of food? Let's start with the girl breakfast. Okay, so it is 10 p.m. Uh, a.m. I have just showered. Don't mind my red face. I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little bit scared <laughs> because I'm actually really hungry. Oh, ducky. Hey. Tuck is already baking bread for me. I hope I'll have some bread for breakfast. I can't look. Oh. Oh. That's my breakfast. I said no redos, right? Why is my face so red? Let's prepare our girl breakfast. I mean, the filter didn't specify what kind of tofu. So I got this rosso tofu. It just said cold tofu. So it's okay if it has some flavor. And here is my girl breakfast. <laughs> Honestly, looking at it now, I think it could be worse. Bon appetit. To be honest, I have a little bit of a tofu, soy, issue <laughs> if i eat too much soy or tofu i can feel it in my belly okay the tofu is not bad it just tastes like tomato i'm so glad i also have tomatoes if i just eat the tofu with the tomato honestly just not a breakfast i will usually go for but it somehow works <laughs> By the way, I'm also not putting any spices or herbs or salt on it unless the filter tells me to. So this is all very plain. Cold tofu do be buzzing. I fucking love tomatoes. I fucking love them. Honestly, that's a really solid breakfast. Mm. I love Reese's. I just never eat them for some reason. For some reason. Good girl breakfast. Okay, it is now lunchtime. I'm hungry. I have to admit my breakfast was not necessarily very filling. So we're gonna have to look what we can get for girl lunch. I hope it's gonna be a lot. I'm very hungry. Give me something good. Um, that is not what I hoped for. Okay, so I wasn't able to find these typical American goldfish chips, but I found these. It's animals. And the goldfish is, I think, also an animal. I don't even know why I put it on the plate. <laughs> For the cat food, there's only so much I can physically take. I'm obviously not gonna eat wet food. <laughs> for you it's for me i'm sorry i'm disappointing you wait i'll share with you let's start with the best thing a camel <laughs> nice and they smell like waffles I'm so hungry. <laughs> Honestly, it just tastes like gross crackers. <coughs> it's starting to taste media and media. You know what? 
I think I'm good. I'll have my dessert now. Yum, mm. thanks for that lunch. Okay, you know what, I need a snack. I'm still a little bit hungry, even though my lunch was so good and nutritious. Okay, chickpeas. Okay, okay. <gasps> Ooh, I'm excited about this. So let's make a pasta salad. I literally just looked up a recipe and I found this recipe for the best and lackest noodle salad ever. ever. Okay, the ever was added by me, but apparently it seems to be good and yummy. And maybe even the best and yummiest. I'm gonna add this flesh worst. <laughs> it's basically like bologna. I don't even know what it is in English, but it's also veggie. You're also gonna cut up some pickles and you're gonna add some yogurt as the dressing, a whole lot of mayonnaise. I added a little bit less mayonnaise than recommended. I'm not crazy, okay? <laughs> a tablespoon of pickle juice, some chicken bouillon, some paprika powder, some garlic powder, basically just, you know, put all of it that in whatever you want then also add some corn and some peas and that's basically it that's the world's best and yummiest pasta salad hopefully okay it is time to plate my afternoon snack my very light snack <laughs> a good spoon full of chickpeas uh, i could have literally just put these in the pasta salad but you know we want to make it the right way and then my absolute favorite milk chocolate Nika no flame honestly i don't really like milk chocolate that much anymore i only like dark chocolate but if i had to eat milk chocolate it would be this one so aesthetics oh, wow happy snack time mm. Mm. I've always loved these type of pasta salads. I just never make them. It's also really good with the veggie meat. You won't be able to tell the difference, I promise. Hmm, some chickpeas. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and here's my chocolate. I mean, you probably know airy milk chocolate. Honestly, I don't think we're gonna get anything better than this today. I think this is the highlight. I already know it. What if I... No. <laughs> so I think I'm ready for my dinner. And I also think I have to do two rounds for the dinner because there is no way I'm gonna go to bed hungry. So let's pray to the girl dinner gods because this time it's actually gonna be the girl dinner. I mean, the pasta salad afternoon snack was also very good. I felt very blessed. Thank you so much. Hoping and praying for my dinner tonight. Okay. Um. Not the sardines. That is, I would say, my appetizer, maybe? I found canned sardines and it's with chili oil. So I'm hoping with the chili, it's gonna be a bit more edible on its own. I wish I had some bread at least. Oh, it smells like I opened a can of cat food. Oh my god, it smells the exact same. My chili already came over. <laughs> He thinks I'm eating his food all day long. <laughs> oh. Oui, oui. Oh, monsieur, c'est le moustache et le sardine en, ensemble. Exquisite et magnifique. <laughs> Do you think red wine is maybe a good combination for that? Maybe it'll like level it up. I bought this wine because the label looked nice. <laughs> I really don't know shit about red wine. I know what kind of white wine I like, but red wine I like never drink. <gasps> Let's just try the sardines by themselves first. It does taste a little bit like canned tuna, just a bit more fishy. It's not bad, but I also don't taste the chili oil. Like, where is it? Let's try it with a good spoon of mustard or fork. Oh, that's not so bad. Actually, the mustard kind of gets rid of the fishiness a little bit because the mustard is like spicy. It's so good with the mustard, so much better. Oh, that wine is also not bad. 
It kind of also works with this food. What is happening? I literally thought I would be throwing up, but instead I'm throwing a party. Wow. I like it. It just says house wine. I guess when I drink it, my name is not Naomi anymore, but Amy house wine. <laughs> and now let's get to the main course or maybe the dessert, depends on what it is. What's for dinner? Huh? Mm? Mm. 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 I hate fake crap. I like instant soup, but I think I can work with those two meals. Instant ramen. I'm gonna make my favorite one, the shin ramen. <laughs> Period. For the vibes, I'm just gonna put in some mayo and a little bit of cream cheese because you guys know I'm a creamy bitch. And now let's put some of these precious fish sticks in there. We call it surimi sticks in Germany, but I think it's literally the same as imitation crab. Look, it's like you can rip it apart. My dad always used to eat these. And I remember trying it once and thinking, what the fuck is this? Like it literally tastes like nothing in my memory, but it does smell kind of fishy though. We ordered Mexican food yesterday. This is what's left of it. Honestly, I don't think it'll be nice microwaved. I usually pan fry my quesadilla and then it's like really crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside and it's really good. Oh Jesus Christ. Can I just put it in there like this? You're doing such a good job in there. Hmm. <laughs> and here is my final girl dinner. Girl. Yummy. Oh, it smells so fishy. I don't know if this ruins my shin ramen for me. Delicious. <laughs> Let's hope for the best. Fair enough. I don't taste it that much. <laughs> Good for me. Wait, now I need to try it on its own. It has a very, very soft fishy taste and not much else. And I have to say it actually does go very well with the shin ramen, with the spiciness of it. It works together. It also is maybe a little sweet. Maybe my um, cream cheese was also a little sweet. Maybe that's the sweetness. Oh, spicy. Oh, it makes me sneeze. <laughs> Let me try my um, quesadilla. Got a little bit of sour cream. I just don't want to make my hands dirty now, so I guess I'm gonna eat it with chopsticks. Mm. <laughs> it's still good, but the texture, the consistency, it's a bit off throwing. But I mean, it still tastes good. Let me try the ultimate bite. Everything! Why not? I'll just let the quesadilla marinate in there. Daddy! It's really good. I love this combo. Ooh, red wine is not so good with spice. Damn, do I have to eat quesadilla with instant ramen now all the time? Woo! <laughs> Honestly, I think I would eat everything that I tried today again, except the cat food, obviously. But everything else was surprisingly good. Like the girl dinner really surprised me. You're still here? Let me eat my girl dinner in peace. So this was my girl day, but now like looking back at it, the sardines and the mustard. Maybe I'm gonna do it again. Because honestly, it was kind of cool to not think about what you're gonna eat and just let somebody else, somebody else decide it. Oh my God, I have a lipstick all over my face. Oh, that's a pimple. <laughs> anyway, giving you a little heads up for um, all of my videos coming in the next weeks. I'm going on tour in September and it's crazy. I'm already <laughs> shitting my pants. But I just want to say that I 
will struggle a little bit with the Sunday video uploads. Uh, I really already tried my best to schedule a video for every Sunday, but I just won't have the time to edit this. Also not to film. This, this attempt is so full, but I try to still get up as much as I can. I'll try to just miss out on maybe one or maximum two dates. So just know that I'm trying, but I don't know how this September will work out. But next week, there will actually be something very special on my channel. Just as a little tour start, a little kickoff into the September tour, a little teasy teaser. It's gonna be a surprise. But yeah, I hope I will see some of you guys on tour. I really, really can wait. I am so freaking excited. <laughs> Don't forget to follow me on all of my social media, which is Naomi John on Instagram. Naomi John on TikTok. And the Naomi John on X. I hate that. I absolutely hate that. Don't we all hate that? What am I gonna do with my life? Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Oh my god, I can't even leave the frame. I'm not wearing any pants. Oh shit, I didn't think about that. Maybe I'm just gonna sink then. I'm gonna sink into my bed. Ooh.